National Football League Championship on the line at Baltimore. Favorites are the hometown Colts, out to become the fourth team in league history to win two straight playoff titles. Vice President Nixon is among the jam-packed crowd with eyes on Johnny Unitas, the great Colt quarterback. The first time that his team comes into possession against the New York Giants, Unitas fakes brilliantly while fleet-footed Lenny Moore gets into position to receive the forward pass. The play covers 60 yards for the Colts' touchdown. The sensationally accurate toe of Pat Summerall notches three field goals for the Giants. They lead 9-7 until the final quarter. Then Unitas and company explode. This pass from the Colts' quarterback to Moore nets 36 yards. Three plays later, Unitas himself eludes giant defenders and goes over for the TD. With the Colts leading 14 to nine, a Charlie Connerly pass is intercepted by Andy Nelson. He returns 17 yards to the Giants 14. Soon the Unitas arm, a bullseye to Jerry Richardson, another Colts touchdown. Brief minutes later, the desperate Giants are passing again. This Connerly aerial is intercepted by Johnny Sample, and he goes 41 yards for still another Colts score. With 24 points in 10 minutes of the last period, the Baltimore Colts crush the Giants 31 to 16 for supremacy of professional football.